Salutations guys, it's Tatum here. Welcome to a new video. How's everyone doing today? Hope you're all doing fantastic. I'm here today in the city of, uh, what city is this? Santa Ana. We're at the Grand Goodwill location. If you guys want to come check it out, tell them hey, Adrian sent you. But if you guys love the free 12 vlogs, home decor videos, live sales, don't forget to subscribe to the little bell button so you're notified about new videos to go up. I'm on Instagram. It's Adrian, just like it's spelled here. And check out the shop, Adrian.com to see what I have for sale from my thrifting adventures. And all oh, the live sales are every Friday and Saturday night at 10 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. But with that being said, let's hop in the store and go see what we can find today. I'm really excited. Hope you can find some good stuff. I'll see you guys inside. All right, let's see what bags we can find. The bags are like really picked over today. Oh, these outdoor tables are so good. Okay, there's like two of them. I wonder how much they are. I think the prices are on the other side. Alright, they're 180. Oh my gosh. I only wish that they were white. I mean, I guess I could spray paint them, but 180 for those guys. Kitchen aid, microwave, drawer thing, some sewing machines, fans, more sewing machines, keyboard. Oh, that yellow chair is kind of nice. Little kitchen set. But you guys, they brought out this cart and had some stuff. I found these. They're not Valentinos, but I mean, they look like Valentinos. And then I found this um, B. McKelsey bag. It has an Amy Kessenberg strap on it, but it's cute. I feel like I always look at these glasses every time I come in. I feel like they're always here and I'm always looking at them. Oh my gosh, these little coasters are so cute. We have Alaska salt and pepper shakers. No. There's a bunch of people in this aisle, so it's kind of hard to film. I didn't think I spotted anything too exciting. Let's go on to the next. So we have all sorts of gadgets and gizmos aplenty over here. Remember that time I found a Dyson vacuum here? Those were good times. I also bought one of my Nespresso machines from here too, which was also very exciting for me. Let's see what's over here. I wonder if this is from Sterla Top. Oh no, it's not. Well, it might be, but the print looks very similar. No, it's Nicole Miller. These look like Pottery Barn plates from before. No. Cute though, I love those little birds. These are fun. One of the knickknacks. All the little penguin cookie jars, Christmas themed. That unicorn scent thing has been here for a hot second. Alright you guys, 
we are at the house now. It's a couple days later, and I'm super excited to show you guys what we ended up getting. So we went to a Goodwill, then after that we went to a Crossroads store. You guys know how much I love Crossroads and Goodwills. So um, let me show you guys what I got first from the Goodwill. Let me start off. Okay, so I got these two. I was at the register, and they had these like sitting right in front. And like I wouldn't have known unless like I was paying for something because they are facing the register, and you won't see them unless you're actually standing at the register and turn around. So um, I'm really excited. I tried these products right now. I took a shower and I don't know I kind of like them we'll see how they are um, but I got the IGK Beach Club volumizing texture texture spray uh, I know that these IGK products are super duper expensive this one was $12 and 99 cents I decided to give it a try um, and so far so good I like it so far and then I also got that I think this is pronounced way um, hair oil and this hair oil it smells so so amazing you guys it smells so so good and I really like it as well I actually tried it that day um, that I got this like in the car because my hair was feeling a little dry I put some of this in there so so good and then um, I tried it again tonight fantastic again I love the smell it smells so good so this was $9.99 a little expensive but these are expensive products um, but yeah, so I'm gonna give them like a try this week and then if I like them hopefully I can get like another one or two of these bottles at the Goodwill again the next time I go because I love hair products and expensive like some hair products are so expensive so I'm always trying to get them at a good deal and those were really great prices I think so happy about that then I also got I don't know why I always find these but um these are actually not authentic. They're not real. They don't say like Valentino or anything, but they look exactly like the Valentino slides. I mean, I found so many like real ones and also so many of these like fake ones, which is crazy, but these are size 41. I think they're too big for mom because I think she might be like a 39 or a 40, um, but they are in brand new condition. I don't, think, I don't think these have ever been worn, but they're super cute. They're just black with the gold studs. They were $5.99. Picked them up. They're in great shape. So I got these guys. And then the only other thing that I got from that store was this B. Mikowski, um handbag. Super cute. Super soft black leather. I love the contrasting Vachetta colored leather trim. The the leather isn't actually Vachetta, it's just Vachetta colored, so it's not going to patina or anything. Uh, it has gold hardware. It also did come with this crossbody strap, but the crossbody strap is actually from an Amy Kestenberg bag, but I mean, it matches, and then you can wear it as a crossbody strap uh, bag if you wanted. This bag has a back zipper pocket. It also has this cool little braided leather detail down the front, and then the interior has a zipper pocket and then two open pockets. So, um, fantastic. This was $6.99. So, happy to get these. Alright, let's put these in there. Now, onto the bags. So, I actually, oh, you know what? I didn't go to Crossroads. I went to that store, and then afterwards, I went to, uh, it was 2nd Street, and then I went to Buffalo Exchange, but I didn't film at either one, I think. So, you, probably, you, guys, probably didn't, you guys didn't see it, but it's, you would have seen it on Instagram. Because I did put some photos up on Instagram. So if you guys don't already follow me on Instagram, definitely follow me there. Because sometimes I don't film at all the stores that I go to. Sometimes I just like run in and out. And sometimes stores don't allow filming. Like Buffalo Exchange doesn't allow filming and all that stuff. So, um, But at 2nd Street, I did get this amazing Kuyana bag. This, You guys, this bag is so stinking cute. The leather is so nice on this. Um, oh, here it is. It says Kuyana right there in the gold writing. Um, it's a crossbody bag. I love the style of it. It kind of reminds me of like an Hermes, kind of reminds me of a Loewe. So it gives me like a lot of, a lot of feels. I really like it. The interior of the bag is just the suede of the leather, of the exterior leather. There's one interior open pocket and yeah, there's the bag. It's beautiful, the leather is so so nice you guys the leather on this is amazing and it smells so good you know like that amazing rich leather smell that some leather bags have this is one of them oh it smells like a gazillion dollars it's beautiful it's fantastic i just love the simplicity and ease of the design and yeah i feel like i could i might actually use this one too it also has two exterior side pockets 
as well, which is nice. So this is a really cute bag. I know Quiana has been really popular recently, and I know it's not like a brand that everyone knows, but the people that do know Quiana love Quiana, and their bags are pretty pricey. So really excited to get this guy. Uh, how much did I get him for? I got it for $19, so with tax it was $20.47. Exciting. Okay, so then, after that I went to Buffalo Exchange, it was across the street, and I got another Rogue bag! I'm so excited! I got a Rogue bag, when did I get it? I think I got it last week. Last week in gray, and it was the larger size, and now I found, I think this is the medium size. Yeah, I think this is the medium and there's a smaller size than this. Um, but this is a Coach Rogue in the uh, blue, like a sky blue pebbled leather. It has uh, all the goodness. It actually was monogrammed with the letters A, B. And then um, I love the interior of this bag because it's a green suede in the two pockets. The middle is a canvas lining with a zipper pocket and then an open pocket right there. So um, I think I got this bag for, how much did I get this bag for? Um, $53.88, that's with tax. So love it. It has the top handles and it has the longer shoulder strap. And I know these bags usually come also with like a crossbody strap. Unfortunately, this one did not come with the crossbody strap, but that's okay. So, super excited. I love this bag so much. It's gorgeous. It's beautiful. And it is, it is it's blue. I love blue. And this is a really good, like, grayish blue color. Like, grayish sky blue, if that makes sense. So, I'm, I really like it. It's pretty, and I love that pop of green on the inside. That makes me so happy. I love a pop of color. So, that actually is it. That's going to end today's video. Thank you guys again so much for watching. Hope you guys had fun um, checking out the... Um, the store, I'm sorry I didn't bring you into Second Street and Buffalo Exchange, but um, definitely follow me on Instagram for more of that behind the scenes thrifting for stuff I don't film for the videos. Um, tune in tomorrow bright and early at 7 a.m. for a new video. And I do have the live sales every week, twice a week, Friday and Saturday night at 10 p.m. Pacific Standard Time if you guys would like to join. Uh, but yeah, see you guys all in the next one. All right, bye!